Revolutionizing the Sustainability Industry. One Community Weekly Progress Update number 84. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. This is our Weekly Progress Update number 84, October 10th, 2014 edition. As always, we're going to be sharing with you our team's accomplishments and progress with videos and pictures. And if you'd like to see more details, more specifics, more pictures, and links to all of the open source content so that you can access those details and read everything at your own leisure, uh, visit our written blog. Also, if you'd like to receive an email update every time one of these updates comes out, uh, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com and we will add you to our newsletter list. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes California state education standards. This week, the core team, which consists of the satellite and pioneer members, finished the final 50% of the love lesson plan behind the scenes. Uh, then we finished the first 25% of the related mind map that you can see here, and we got the first 50% of the web page created. All of this is purpose to teach all subjects to all learning levels, pre-K through college, within the context and the central theme of love. We also finished the final 50% of the signs lesson plan web page, teaching all subjects to all ages using the central theme of signs and symbology. This page is open source and usable right now in any educational environment. Behind the scenes, we also finished another 20% of the lesson plan design with central theme of recreation, bringing us to 70% complete there. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined, and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team working on highest good food finished three more complete breakout pages from the large scale gardening page. These included the corn page, the cucumber page, and the eggplant page, all with detailed descriptions, planting guidelines, cultural considerations, and this new format that loads faster and gives us the space we'll need to add recipes, gardening tips, harvesting and canning tips, videos, and more. Contact us if you have any great resources related to any of these plant species, as we'd love to add those to these pages too. In this area of our open source project, we are seeking permaculturalists, an irrigation specialist, a surveyor, and a chef to join our team as either consultants to the project or pioneers who will be moving onto the property with us. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week's core team working on highest good housing Finish the final formatting and additional details for another 25% of the Earthbag Construction Dome Home Energy Infrastructure Instructional webpage. You can see that here, and this is a component of the upcoming crowdfunding campaign. This brings us to 75% complete with this page, and when the page is totally done, it will be the most detailed and comprehensive Dome Home Electrical Instructional available. Behind the scenes, we also are now done with 15% of the Plumbing Instructional 
which will also be equally as detailed as this electrical instructional. In addition to this, we added the energy rollout and phasing in details for 50 to 100 people, creating off-grid village energy infrastructure. Uh, you can see this here, and the rest of the phase in details for 10 to 20 people and 20 to 50 people are on the complete page. We also completed an assessment of all the components in the sustainable village models and their individual peak wattage contributions, which you can see here. We combine this with the new assessment of the total energy contributions, which you can see here. All of this was to assist with our energy uh, strategy in the event of a power emergency. If you want to read all about it, you can visit our written blog or you can see the complete explanations on the new FAQ section of the Highest Good Energy page. Last but not least, Dave Wallen, architectural drafter and designer and owner of Dave Philip Wallen Design, also began a redesign of the Straw Bale Village Pod 2 to eliminate the rounded walls and to make this village model significantly easier and more affordable to build. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician. If you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team completed the final Duplicable City Center 3D video renders and wrapped up the video with last week's still renders. Here's the final clip of the video we added, and you can see the complete video showing this structure in 3D from start to finish over two years of design work, uh, all up on the Duplicable City Center open source hub. We also finished the first 50% of the property-wide hydronic setup details page, which you can see here. This covers setting up the hot water heating systems for portable showers and the initial building teams with a short discussion of how the components will later be integrated into the Duplicable City Center and other permanent structures. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week, the core team updated and featured our World Change Strategy Overview page, which is the simplest overview of what it is we are creating and why. It outlines our four-phase strategy that we are implementing and how we see this as a path to a new era of cooperation, collaboration, innovation, creativity, sustainability, and increase peace and happiness for all of humanity. In this area of the project, we're seeking graphic designers, web designers, and technology specialists, videographers, and building a highest good legal team. If you or someone you know fits these descriptions and would like to join our highest good society creation process. One community is revolutionizing the sustainability industry. The way that we're doing this is through open source creation and a highest good of all philosophy for free sharing everything that it is that we do in a way that can be duplicated either as individual components or as complete teacher demonstration communities, villages, and cities designed to be built around the world. Spreading sustainable infrastructure and supporting all industries associated with sustainability. Our idea is if we make it easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate as attractive enough, we can stimulate this entire industry in a way that promotes not only sustainability, but also the complete concept of open source and free sharing what it is that you create. By doing this, our idea is to show people that by sharing, by cooperating, by collaborating, you can build a business better. You can live a better lifestyle. You can help other people. Putting all these concepts together in teacher demonstration, communities, video, <laughs> communities, villages, and cities to be built around the world as solution models that teach other people how to create solution models too. This is an idea that has the potential to change life on this planet for everyone. 
And this is why we talk about revolutionizing the sustainability industry, because we feel that nothing short of that is going to create the global transformation that is necessary. Addition, in addition to this, what we're doing is we're combining an emotional sustainability component. Right now, sustainability is mostly considered a physical sustainability type of situation. You have food, energy, and housing. But there's also an emotional sustainability component that is equally as important, or possibly even more important. It's that idea of creating fulfilled lifestyles. It's the idea of an education program that is a new paradigm education program that addresses the, the reality that people want to spend more time with their kids. They want their kids to have a better education. People are saying to wake up to the idea that a child sitting and just reading a book all day long is really not the way to learn. That a more hands-on process that could be facilitated by a complete teacher demonstration environment is a good idea. And then we add into that the for-profit and non-profit highest good economic models as well. Businesses designed specifically to help people get out of debt, to build abundance in ways that help other people in ways that are collaborative and cooperative. Building a global co-op of people interested in creating these teacher demonstration communities, villages, and cities and hubs for the highest good of all. For the highest good, for the highest good of all people and all life on this planet. Building it in a way that is open source and free share to make it easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate as attractive enough so that we can not only revolutionize the sustainability industry, but revolutionize the way that people look at living. So we can reach to the very core the very foundations of how people look at life and demonstrate a better way. And so if you dig into our website, if you take a look at everything that we're creating, you will see the specifics, the details of what this looks like. What is the social architecture? What is this model of living that most people will consider to be far superior to the way that they're living now? How is it possible to give people more free time and still be able to accomplish all of our global transformation goals? All these details are outlined on the website. So if this sounds fun to you, if this sounds exciting to you, if this sounds interesting to you, if you are a creator, if you're an innovator, if you're a creative thinker, if you're an architect or an engineer of the future, if you're somebody who wants to make a difference or somebody who knows that to be the change we want to see in the world, we have to demonstrate that. We have to walk the walk. We have to do the work. And if the work is something that you enjoy, if the work is something that you would like to be a part of, get involved in our team. Join our world-changing elite team of people that are working on these solutions, creating these solution models so that we can share them, and free sharing and open sourcing everything, every step of the way. As our creative process moves forward, we are sharing constantly. And so we're looking for the people who want to participate in that. The other big thing that we're looking for is we're looking for large-scale funding. Predominantly, we're looking for somebody to help us take the property off the market. If we could find somebody to either donate to our 501c3 or to invest in our project and help us take the property off the market, it would be the number one largest thing that would help our project right now. We've been working with this property now for four years. We've built the relationships with the county, and we're ready to purchase it. But we need that financial support, that financial help to do it. And once we do that, we can share the location. We can put boots on the ground and start doing a lot of the assessments and things that are necessary specifically on the ground and we can open source that whole process to help other people who are doing the same thing in other places all over the world. Like what is the process of landing on a property and setting it up? What is it that you're looking for? How do you want to prepare? And so our team is ready to do that. We just need, the, need somebody to help us take the property off the market. So if you're somebody who knows somebody or if you are that individual, we would love to hear from you. And of course, we always like to say thank you for all the small donations. None of our team is paid. We're not a nonprofit organization where there's a hierarchy that's getting paid to do what it is that we're doing. We are a nonprofit organization where we are 100% volunteer workers. Everybody that's doing everything for one community is not paid to do it. We're doing it all for altruistic reasons. We're doing it all because we know that it's what needs to happen and because we're committed to this idea of evolving the sustainability industry. So thank you for the small donations. Thank you for following our progress. Thank you for sharing everything that we create on Facebook, Twitter, we are on all the social media networks, so to the people that share our, our content, thank you. That's the other thing that is probably one of the hugest things that can help us out, is to continue to get this information out there. To subscribe to our, our YouTube channel, to send us an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com and, and get on our email list, and then when you see something that you like or you see something that could benefit somebody, if you see an open source piece that you think should get out there, share it. 
We're on all the different social media networks to make it as easy as possible. We're on Pinterest. We're on Reddit. We are on Twitter. We are on Facebook. We are on LinkedIn. We are on Tumblr. And we're on another 10 or 12 different social media networks in addition to all those to make it as easy as possible for people to share everything that it is that we're doing, get the information out there, and so other people can become a part of this revolutionary process as well. So thanks for following our progress. Thanks for sharing our information. If you're somebody that would like to join our team or get involved, by all means, do that. And uh, until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thank you.